Hey guys, I didn't do my hair for this video, but I wanted to show you some clothes that I got. This is a top from Old Navy that I really like. And on the same order from The Gap, I got these jeans. I'm not sure what I think about them because they're a little bit baggy. Oh, here, let me see if I can put you down a little bit. These are a size 10, I believe. Oh no, I guess they would be a size 12. Are they a size 12? They're a size 31 waist. They are big in the waist. I wanted them a little bit bigger so that they would be comfortable. I can wear them with a belt and then kind of tuck this in. Yeah, actually, I like this. I know I need shoes on, but we're Canadian. We don't wear shoes in the house, so I don't have anything here with me. I'm gonna have to put some here. It's pretty basic, but I'm basic. And this is actually nice and thin. I need to wear a new bra with it, but it hangs nicer because it's thin. You know, if it's really thick, it kind of just pops out like that. <laughs> and this one flows nice, so. I should tell you what these are. They're the 90s loose mid-rise. This wasn't planned out because I have a hat on, but I just wanted to get this up and show you. If I wait for the perfect moment, it's never gonna happen. I got this dress from Old Navy. I wasn't really sure about this one because of the bra situation, but underneath, I'm gonna show you what's underneath. This is from Aerie. It's a top. I will never wear this top like this. I don't know what made me think of buying this except for that I thought maybe it would look cute under overalls just to have an option. Anyway, it turns out to be a perfect bra for this dress. It's got a little slit, but nothing too much that you see on my legs. This, I'm not sure about. I'll have to make sure I tan the whole. <laughs> I got this from American Eagle. I think American Eagle or Aerie, I'm not sure. I bought one of these last year in a medium and it really felt like it was too big. Like you can always see my bra. The straps were too long and obviously this is quite loose. So I just needed the straps to be shorter. So I got a small. It's not the most flattering top in the world. If you're dealing with hot flashes and you don't want anything tight around your waist, this can be really cute, I think, especially with a fitted pant. Now let's put this over top. Yeah, see, that's cute. I just tucked this in a little bit just to give me some kind of shape in my waist. I just hope I don't ruin it because this can get caught on so much. But it's nice and comfortable. It actually feels cozy, but I'm not gonna die of heat. These jeans are from American Eagle as well. I bought them last year. I'm not sure if they're still available, but I love these. They're nice and soft and they're the most flattering jeans I own. I wanted to show you a couple things I got at Winners and I feel bad because I don't think I can find any of these things to link them for you, but maybe we can get style ideas together. I obviously wouldn't wear a hat with this outfit. Oh, that's better. It's adjustable. Anyway, I remember wearing patterns like this in the 90s. 90s. And the 90s are coming back. So I saw this and I thought, oh, that looks kind of cute. Really nice and light for the summer. Oh, that's actually not bad. And I got this at Winners. Maybe I'd put my hair up. Well, anyway, the only thing is I feel like I need a belt. I want to introduce you to my cleaning lady sometime because she has so much style and it's not fair because she's cleaning so she doesn't look her best. She is so good with fashion. I run everything by her. So she told me to accessorize. This is something I bought from Target a while ago on my Miami trip, but I think I need something longer. And I have lots of silver because I used to sell silver. Silpata. Where's Bridget when I need her? God, I have some good jewelry from them. Is that too much? Something like that? I love how I'm talking to you like you're going to answer back. I wonder if you could find these on Poshmark or eBay. I'm not sure about this one. I think I'd be better off with a pendant or something. I have this ring that I got in Mexico or another Silpata ring. If I can find links to this jewelry, I will try to help you out. I feel excited. I have to say, I'm so inspired by other women getting on here and showing their style. Seeing other women on here is teaching me and helping me so much. I'm gonna go show Bridget and get her approval. I think having more color at the bottom kind of grounds it a little bit because it's darker up here. There. I never have good luck with white tops, but this I love and I knew I'd like it because the material is weighty and flowy. Sometimes when you have a white top, even if you wear a nude bra, you can see everything. I hate that. So bad news is I got this from Winners, so I'm not sure if I could find a link for you or not. And this is not sponsored in any way. Winners or Marshalls, if you're watching this, I'd love a sponsorship. <laughs> so this is a really good find. Let me see how much this was. The brand is Velvet Heart. It's made out of whatever this is called. Can anyone pronounce it? Tensile? It says it feels so right, and it does. There's a huge difference in the way this feels and lays. I got a size large, and this was $34.99 Canadians. Here in the US, do you have a Winners? Or is it just Marshalls? They're very similar. Oh, this is cute. Of course, my sleeves have just rolled up to here. Look at me, I actually am kind of fashionable. Let me roll this down. Was it supposed to be rolled up? That's pretty down too, if I iron that out. Hey, that's cute. Is it too much with the tail hanging out? I don't think so. Can I wear it with these shoes? I do have a link to these in my light to know it. I highly doubt I can find you a link to this stuff. I'm just trying to give you style ideas and ask for your opinion. 
What do you think? DKNY, that's why. I got a US size 10. So if you don't know, I am a 36D, 31 waist, 41 and a half hip, I think. Again, not sponsored at all, but I would recommend going at the first of the season so everything's not picked over. I love what I found and I hope this helps and I will see you later. Bye.